So, what do you think? That looks delicious. <laughs> Good, because there's about a dozen more of them out in the kitchen. I figured, why tempt fate this year? I mean, we always end up ordering pizza at the last minute on Thanksgiving. So why not do it up proud this time? Order from the best. So, Chef Santora at his Michelin-rated restaurant. Just pointing out the pizza oven I wanted would have done exactly the same thing. <laughs> I'll get it. Well, uh, looks like you did yourself this year. Oh, <laughs> hey, I can order with the best of them. <laughs> Asking everyone to bring a donation for the local soup kitchen was a very nice touch. Well, I really didn't want to go through the stress of a big meal only to wait around for it to implode. <laughs> now, this year, I, I wanted to focus on what's, what really matters, and that's family. Olivia, you? Invited Julie to Thanksgiving. Hey, buddy! What's up? Happy Thanksgiving. I do a turkey for you. You want to see it? I'd love that. And besides, I think your mommy and uh, Ted here have some things to talk about. His name's Ned, silly. Oh, my mistake. Leo, this is awesome. It's a really nice turkey. <laughs> I'm going to add a dog. That's a good idea. Every, every turkey needs a dog. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, are we all set? Pardon? Have yeah, we made the arrangements? If Oscar wins his lawsuit, your people will grab him, they'll go to Brazil, and he'll be forced to receive the treatment. You're mad. I know. I just don't understand why you wouldn't warn me about Julian coming. Because I knew that you would object. And with, with good reason, Ned, and I needed you to see with your own eyes how much this would mean to Leo. I do. And I'm trying to be mature about that. Honey, honey, no one is gonna replace you in Leo's life. You're the one that's there for him day in and day out, but we owe it to him to learn how to coexist with Julian. That's a very different tune you're singing these days. I know, it's because I've seen how much Julian has changed since he's gotten out of prison. He's a different man than he used to be. Hello? Dr. Monroe, Monica Quartermain. I just wanted to let you... The box of donated food is still in the kitchen, and I thought the volunteer from the soup kitchen was going to pick it up about an hour ago. Well, that's weird. I thought I saw the housekeeper opening the door to him a while back, so... Well, is he still here? I mean, he didn't go away empty-handed, did he? No, no, no. I saw someone carrying something out of the kitchen. Yeah, but the donated food is still there. What would he have? <gasps> the, the pizza! pizza! Okay, those don't look like Chef Santora's words. Uh, no, they're not. Uh... He accidentally donated the gourmet pizzas to the soup kitchen, and I don't really in good conscience think we can ask for them back. No, no, that would definitely not be good for my poll numbers. <laughs> well, you know, when, when has any quarter main Thanksgiving gone as planned, right? So it's nice to know that the tradition continues. Mm-hmm. Okay, then, you know the drill. First, First we, we sing, sing and then, then we, we eat. eat. Okay, Ned? Ready? <laughs> we gather together to ask the Lord's blessing. He chastens and hastens his will to make known the wicked oppressing now cease from distressing. Sing praises to his name. He forgets not his own. Oppressing now.